The surveying and spatial industry is currently in the middle of huge change um, from a digital perspective. Because we can capture the data in 3D now, digital models such as a digital twin can get created from the data. And this is allowing project teams to access this data at any point in time from, from a laptop or from wherever they are in real time. And then to be able to use that data collaboratively to then plan all facets of the project, such as planning, design, and asset management. My role as Senior Digital Engineering Manager is to ensure that everything is as per ISO 19650. And uh, I'm working with an amazing team of digital engineers to implement all of the design requirements of this standard. IM360 Ops combined with Autodesk Tandem will enable asset management team to have access to digital twins and uh, arrange different kind of uh, maintenance and operation activities for their assets. PWASD team has modeled North Grafton STP project uh, using advanced methods of digital engineering. They have now live clash detection for North Grafton STP project. Some of our clients don't have the platforms or processes in place. To, to undertake these digital processes. But that's where Public Works can come in, adopt our approach to provide a contemporary solution for our clients. So within the Survey and Spatial Group, we're currently investing heavily in 3D capture technology. So LiDAR systems for our drones, terrestrial LiDAR systems, handheld laser scanning systems. So pre all these are different tools to capture 3D point clouds of the real world environment. So then reality models and 3D models can get created in a in a CAD environment. The opportunities with technology are endless at PWA, I think, um, because our projects cover a wide variety of um, disciplines and um, pipelines and roads and um, flood recovery and things like that. And we're using it across a variety of projects as well. Um, in Batemans Bay Coastal Headlands Walking Trail, um, we used it, developed a a web app to um, to showcase where the trail was going. Um, there's fulcrum data in there as well. So when um, uh, one of our staff walked along the trail, they were able to take photos of where there in, where improvements needed to be made, or where um, or potential vista shots. So we're able to pull that into the web app, um, and we produced a, a public facing version of that as well that is on the, it's on the Eurobidella Council website. It's an exciting time to be working in PWA as we look for continuous improvement on all fronts for not only our staff, but to improve our interactions with clients as well. And technology is at the forefront of that.